good morning guys welcome back to a new vlog i just got ready for the day i did try to put on some new nails they were these but i didn't realize that they had like the adhesive on them already to stick them on there and so they're popping off because as you guys know i like to use my nail glue um, but I couldn't because this one had like a, like a sticker on it already. So I put them on last night <clears throat> and I already lost two of them. But I wanted to intro you guys back into the vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe so you guys don't miss out on any new uploads. Right now I just have to pick out a new set because these aren't going to do it. Well, these are really cute. I might do these. I could, I could also do these. Okay, it'll be between these two. I do really have to start packing. What I really wanna do is pack up this closet because this closet, I'll show you guys. This closet has all of my like cold weather stuff and I'm obviously, please don't mind the mess. And I'm obviously just not using that stuff right now. So I think it's easy if I start with that stuff just to have it packed so it's like, out of sight out of mind um and yeah all right i'm just gonna head downstairs make a coffee and then head to work it's thursday so okay i love you guys oh wait one more thing so today's thursday i believe well i'm i'm fully caught up to the summer i turned pretty i believe they come out every thursday or they come out on thursdays correct me if i'm wrong down in the comments but new episodes come out on thursdays which first off i didn't realize that it was an ongoing show i thought it was a show that had already came out but it's ongoing so and i hate watching shows like that because i hate waiting for new episodes to come out but um i'm caught up and today's thursday i think a new episode is dropping today um so yeah that's the update on that okay now i love you guys good morning it is friday i am gonna get ready for the day i did my hair i put cute little gold um what is that called pins in it it's a little earlier than i usually get ready i want to go and get some coffee before work so i'm trying to like rush and do that i put on my favorite sunscreen that has like shimmer in it let's do some sunscreen on my face of course we're gonna go in with my sun bum and i'm actually running out of my hyaluronic acid so i have to like re-up on it so, oh wait i did my nails again and then let's just do some eyebrow stuff i was gonna do mascara but we're not doing mascara today because when i put mascara on i forget that i have it on and then i want to rub my eyes last step my Fenty Heat, and this is in Fussy Heat. I've been liking her, she's like a pink color. Look how pretty. And that is it. So we're gonna go run to Starbucks, get some coffee, and then we're gonna head to work. I really, I know I say this in like every clip, but I really have to start to pack. It is the 28th, I believe. Yeah, the 28th. Actually, my birthday isn't exactly a month, August 28th. <laughs> I'm not gonna do anything crazy for my birthday um, because I'm gonna have just moved into my apartment and like who has time for that? But I really wanna get like a heart cake, like those vintage heart cakes that, they, that are like going viral right now. Um, I really want one of those. So I have to see what bakery around me, because I feel like in New York, there's bakeries everywhere that could like do anything you need. But here in Arizona, like I have to find one. And it's probably in Phoenix, which is 30 minutes away from where I live. Um, so I have to do some research and see what bakeries could do that cake for me. If you guys know of any place that does vintage cakes like this, like the hard cakes in Arizona, let me know down below so I can get a cake for next month on that note on that note i'm gonna go downstairs and we're gonna head to starbucks 
so I just got my coffee and I was just listening to this song and my Starbucks has been like writing little notes on my coffees like our coffees lately and so she wrote this one on mine and I was like stop I was li literally just listening to that song and she goes thank god because I was afraid the person who got that coffee wouldn't get the reference I was like nah girl I get the reference and I agree I agree I'm a 10 I'm a 10 period so I got my coffee and then I also got a cheese danish isn't it so cute? Yeah. Look. She a baddie with her baddie friends. Cute. The girls at my Starbucks are so nice. Literally every time I pull in there, they're so nice. They're just so nice. Like, I have no complaints. I tried to order, like, a cheese danish on the website. And I said they were out of stock, right? So I asked her. I'm like, hey, like, um, do you guys have any cheese danishes in stock? And she goes, yeah, well, we have some. I'm like, oh, can I have one? And she goes, yeah. I'm like, you know, like the app just told me that you guys didn't have, so I thought I'd ask. She goes, oh, I'm so sorry about that. I'm like, no, it's not. It's not your fault. It's not your fault. She's like, so nice about it. I was like, no, 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 no. I'm not blaming you at all. It's not your fault. But can I have one? Can I have one, please? <laughs> it's friday guys hopefully the day goes by really fast and i hope you guys have a great day and i love you guys morning i got these cute earrings off of amazon it came in like a multi-pack with all of these i have a picture right here but i have a link in my amazon storefront they're such good quality i'm actually obsessed with them but i wanted to give you guys a little update so i started packing as you guys saw in the last clip i started to pack um i have boxes right over there I move in two weeks. On Sunday, I went to Target with my nephew, but I didn't vlog all weekend. All weekend, basically, I was either working or packing. And I got a few stuff, so I wanted to show you guys what I got because I needed a new edge brush. This is the edge gel that I use. I'm not sure that I love it yet because my hairs do come up. You can kind of tell, but um, this is the edge glue that I've been I keep saying edge glue it's not edge glue this is the edge gel that i use i got these little bands to like hold my hair back i used to have bands like this all the time growing up because it was very easy with my curly hair it wouldn't get like stuck in my curly hair um but i've never seen one like this i know we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna test it out with my curly hair and this one too and then i got a re-up of my favorite serum for the nighttime i partner this with my um, La Roche Posay moisturizer. It's divine. Okay, this Elf Halo Glow blush. Very excited about it. Um, yeah, and that's all that I got from Target. I, as you guys can see, I have no nails. I'm gonna put a new set on today. But and when I'm wearing pink, did you guys realize or notice that I'm not wearing black? What do we think? What do we think? That's all that's happening right now. I'm gonna go downstairs make a coffee and then i have to head to work i did also buy an ice maker because um the fridge that i have in my apartment doesn't make ice at least i don't think so and also doesn't dispense water so i have to get a water dispenser and i also have to get an ice maker because i drink water like a fish that's really all that's happening right now i haven't really vlogged all week for you guys because it's just been overwhelming with moving like yes um when i was packing the other day i was like getting a little bit emotional because i'm like i just moved here like i just moved into this house it's been three years but like my parents did a great job with like making sure that we had a consistent like living situation um the last place that i lived in in new york before we moved to arizona we lived there for like 10 years um and i don't know for me it's like places get very like nostalgic and 
it just like hit me hard that like I'm gonna be moving my family is still staying here so I think that's really what's like getting me is because my family we're all very close so the fact that like I'm moving out of the house alone like I'm the I'm the only one that's leaving again like my sister too but like I mean like my parents are staying here my brother's staying here it just for me that's very I don't know I don't know if you grew up in a Hispanic household you know that we are known to have multi-generational homes because in this home like we live here my parents live here my me and my two siblings live here and my nephew lives here so it was just making me a little sad that I had to like pack up because but like I'm 25 like get out of your mom's house but at the same time it's like that's just so normal for for Hispanic households like I definitely didn't feel like pushed like my dad definitely was like are you sure you want to move out I didn't feel pushed to move out but it's just more so like I just want some independence you know um I've had a job since I was 18 years old so like that was never like a, I was never depending on my parents financially but I think with me completely moving out like that's going to be like the ultimate test to being completely independent yeah i think this is going to be good because i'm going to be completely independent like i'm not going to be depending on anyone and again like i don't mean financially i mean just like emotionally i don't have to like depend on my parents and i also feel like i have been very sheltered in my life my parents did a good job of like sheltering me and making sure that i wasn't exposed to like all this crazy stuff but at the same time like i'm ready to experience those things i'm ready to see what's out there in the world and it's scary like bills like I've, obviously i've had bills to pay like my phone bill my car payment like gas like those kinds of things i've had to worry about but like now it's like rent electricity water like it's gonna be a whole different ball game so i'm very excited about it because it's a new journey it's a new chapter in my life and i'm ready for it um and of course i know like my parents are always going to be here so that does make me feel a little a little bit better but i don't know i was packing up the other day and i was like wow i'm not going to be living here anymore it makes me kind of sad but they live down the block for me like i'm live i'm literally moving down the block and me and my mom work together so i'm going to see her every day but anyways let's stop rambling let's go downstairs make a coffee and then we have to head to work i just got home from working and i am going to end the vlog here i apologize for the shorter vlog but this week's just been so hectic so there's just a mess everywhere like my bed's a mess that corner's a mess my makeup station's a mess so i just have to like get my life in order and again i apologize for the short vlog but there's just there hasn't been much to vlog a lot of content is coming soon because when i move out i'm going to be able to vlog everything and also the moving content is coming so make sure you guys stay tuned for that um and again i'm so sorry for the short vlog but i love you guys so much and i will see you guys in the next vlog